Let's talk about adding a vocabulary for a second language. We'll also explore how to make sure that the voice matches the language. So I'm going to go to, from my Grid Explorer, I'm gonna to go to Menu and Add Grid Sets. And then from here, I'm going to change the length of the um, country. I'm gonna choose Spanish. And I am going to choose a symbol-based communication vocabulary. And then I'll say next. And I'm going to choose vocab, or I'm sorry, voca chat, sorry. And hit next. And then this is the Spanish version of Boca Chat. So I will hit next and add. So I'm gonna close. I'm not gonna go right into that vocabulary yet because I want to first make sure my language is on my voices to choose from. So I'm going to go to menu and settings and then I'll go to speech. And then I'm gonna go into voices. Now, I've already set this up as Spanish. So normally it probably would be with in, in English. Um, and so, but you would select this drop down, And then if I was in English, it would look like this. And then I would then select the drop down to find Spanish. I have already downloaded two Spanish voices, Anna and Emilio. But yours probably will be all under the downloadable. But for time's sake, um, I've already downloaded. So what you will do is you will simply just select the one that you want to download, and then you'll select this button that says download. It will take a little bit of time to download, and then it's going to have you restart the um, grid three, which is fine. And then once it has restarted, it will be in the installed area. And so then you can select that voice once it's in the installed area and say, okay. It's gonna have you restart your computer and it may ask you again to select it and then restart again, and that's fine. Then finally, when you get to this point, it's an installed and it's, in, uh, it's there solidly, then you can just select it and say, okay. So now I'm gonna say, okay, because that's the voice I want. And when I go into my Spanish um, version, now I have a voice Quiero. that matches the language. Ver algo. I hope that helps.